The new Wilkes-Barre Area High School is welcoming students for the first time this morning as the district marks a new chapter. WBRE WYOU Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Rogers has more. I'm excited for cheering on like, the games and all that and like bringing up a bunch of school spirit. Today it's exciting as you can see it is the first inaugural day of the students coming to Wilkes-Barre Area High School. So we are all excited and uh, we're just getting ready to get them in here and get the day going. The Wolf Pack consists of three former high schools, Coughlin, Myers and J.R. High Schools. Students have mixed emotions about their first day. Nervous and excited with the new school. I think it's just going to be a lot different than what we've had in the past. Some students are concerned about over 2,000 students packing into one building during the pandemic. Well, there's, like I said, like tons of people, so, you know, it's probably going to spread really fast if there's any at all. But, you know, lots of people are wearing their masks, which is really good. But others say they aren't too worried about it. But I think the school's taking the right precautions to keep us safe, and that's all that we can hope for, really. At the end of the day, these students say they're just excited to be back in school socializing with their friends. Yes, I'm excited to be with people excited. again. Just being with people. Yeah. I like social. I'm a social butterfly, so. The new state-of-the-art building cost around $80 million, but the district is expected to be reimbursed for around 33% of the project. Many say the education students can receive here will be priceless. Nicole Rogers, 2822 Eyewitness News. Police and school staff were out this morning directing traffic to mitigate concerns about potential delays. They'll resume when school lets out later this afternoon.